So we have a circle graph total number of student body. So we're gonna find okay how many students body per mass of year. So we need to find okay percent on these sections. So when you make the line over here, each quarter has 25%. So this one has 25%, but this side, the other side is what? Vertical angles. They are equal, okay? So this is also 15%. Total is 40% on this math sections. Okay, so 40 student of 40%, 0.4 times 40 equals to 16 students, okay? That's the number of student in on math sections. Now number two, 3R plus 5 is 10. What is the value of 6R plus 5? You know that 3R equals minus 5, both sides is going to be 5. So twice over this one is 10, so 6R equals 10. Put this number in there, okay? 10 plus 5 equals 15. The answer is B. The number 3, a to the negative 2 equals 1 over 5. a to the negative 2 is about 1 over a square, that is equal to 5. From here, a square is 5. This is 5, okay? So 5 times 5 is 25, which is okay? The number 4, p is divided by 10. When you can use a division, p divided by 10 over here. This is divisors. There is a quotient decay, the remainder is r. This r is less than 10, right? How can you express this number, which is dividend? p equals divisor times quotient n plus r. Okay, that's the equation. But we need to express what r in terms of other one. r equals how much? p minus 10k. Okay, choice a is the answer. All right, number five. 5 over 12 equals 1 over a plus 1 over b, we're going to find a plus b. Product is given. So 5 over 12, you can simplify this one. Okay, common denominator is a times b. a, b by numerator, we multiply times b, times b, times a, times a, right? So b plus a. But we know that a, b equals 24. To find these numbers, 5 times 24, right? 5 times 24 and divide by 12, it is b plus a. So this is 1 and 2, b plus a is a 10. Okay, choice d is the answer. Number 6, we have a quadratic, y equals negative x, Q, uh, x squared plus 9. So the length of ma is 5, this length is 5. But what is the length of at, this length? This is a symmetry, right, in the y-axis. Now put this number in there, you can find y x coordinate. If this is a 5, 5 equals negative x squared plus 9. What is the x squared equals to 4, right? So x is what? Plus minus 2. So this is a negative 2, the other one is 2, okay? From here, you can find the length of at. 2 minus minus 2 is what? 4, okay? 4 is the answer. Number seven, we have two rectangles. AB is a four, AD is a two. So this is two, same thing. And what is the area of a shady region? I can divide by this into two, okay? What well, you can use by right, the whole thing, which is a trapezoid. This is base is a four, height is a two, half of the base. If this is eight, this also half of the base is a four, okay? What is the area of this triangle? 4 times 832 and divided by 2 is 16 is the area of this triangle. But this rectangle is how much? 2 times 8 is 16. So 16 plus 16 is 32 is the answer, okay? The number 8. The system has infinitely many solutions. Exactly what these two lines is the same equations, equivalent, which is what the two lines are coincident, the same line, m equals l, okay? So you can use their ratio, okay, of their coefficients, same, okay, so a over 3 must be equal to negative b over 1 uh, and 9 over 3, they are always true. This one is what, 3, okay, so a equals how much? 3 times 3 is 9, negative b equals what? 3, so b equals negative 3, okay, so a plus b is 9 plus negative 3 equals the 6, that's, okay, that's the number 8. Uh, number nine here. We have right 
equation g of x, some selected number of year. Okay. So they are talking about the factor. Where is the factor? Factor means by x intercept. When x is negative 2, that is 0. When x equals 3, that is also 0. This is the kind of like, looks like this way, okay? Pass through what x axis. So actually, g of x is what? Factor of this point, x plus 2, right? Minus minus is x plus 2. At this point, they're going to have a factor of negative 3, okay? Anyway, when this is 0, the x intercept is what? x equal negative 2, x equal 3, okay? So x plus 2 is a factor of this one. X minus 3 also factor of g of x, okay? So 1 and 3 is the answer, okay? Remember, x intercept at this point, on this point, y equals 0, okay? They create a factor, okay? So number 10, y is inversely proportional to x squared. Inversely proportional to x squared means what? Product of these two numbers always constant. Y times x squared always constant, same not fixed number. When y is 10, x is 2, 2 squared is 4, the value of k is always 40. The product of these two numbers always equals to 40, okay? Not using this one, when x is 10, what is the value of y? Y, x is 10, 10 squared is 100. This is also a product also be 40, okay? So y equals 40 over 100, 2 over 5, okay? 0.4 is the answer. Okay, number 11. This is the factor of the form. It's going to have, right, if k doesn't matter, right, positive or negative. I'm going to this way. Assume the k is positive, this is a negative 2, this is a positive form, right, x intercept. That's why they have a factor of x minus 4, x plus 2, something like this one over here, okay? So where you have vertex over here, a and b. Uh, what is the value of a? x coordinate, only in the middle of these two points. So 4 plus negative 2 divided by 2, that is the value of A, okay? So that is 2 over 2, it's okay? 2 over 2 is 1, that's right? So the value of A is 1, okay? The number 12. This is isosceles right triangles, okay? But you got to be careful, right? The figure not drawn to scale, okay? Always using this coordinate. So this is isosceles. These two sides are equal. Okay, this is what six. So the length of this side is a six minus 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 one equals a seven, right? This is also seven. Okay, but this y coordinate is negative one. From here you can add a seven there. Okay, it's gonna be six dense, Okay, but actually this is a graph will pass the origin. Okay, so this one. Okay, six is dense anyway. <clears throat> okay, we continue. I'll search into 20 next video, okay? Thank you so much. I'll see you in the next video.